to heal. Good boy. Okay, so I've got Mochi out here working on his heel. This is loose leash walking on our left hand side. So he is right here next to my leg and he is chasing a butterfly. Come on, heel. He is right here next to me and I'm able to have a nice relaxed arm and a nice relaxed leash. That way there's no tension on his collar. Good heel, Mochi. Good boy. This should take up the majority of your walks now. And then a little bit of your walks can be where you release him to go to the bathroom or sniff and kind of do his own thing. But the majority of his walks should be where he's right here next to you walking at your pace and kind of paying attention to you. Good heel, Mochi. Mochi, sit. Good boy. If you need to take a break, tie your shoes, anything like that, you can just ask Mochi to sit. And then when you're ready to walk again, you'll just ask Mochi to heal. Good boy, Mochi. Good boy. Heel. When I change directions, I like to remind Mochi what he's doing. Heel. That way he's less likely to get confused going around those turns. Good boy, Mochi. Good heel. If he were to get ahead of me or sniff and want to do his own thing when I don't release him, we're just going to say no, give him a quick pop and release of his collar, and then remind him that he's supposed to be healing. But he's doing a good job right now. Mochi, sit. Good boy. Good boy. So that's heal and sit.